Hello everyone, this is Heavy Rain, again. It's been maybe about two or three weeks, or maybe I'm exaggerating. It's been a little bit since I've played this. Uh, we're going into quite an intense scene again. That seems to be everything we're getting so far. So I'm going to a market just now and I have to beat a guy. Let's get on with it. And we're with Norman Jaden again. And then it will be Scott, whatever his second name is after this. God, this is going to be hell. I can already feel it. Oh, I have no hope. Oh. Hello, you. Was that the first time? Sorry? First time you killed somebody. So it followed on from that, yeah. It always does something to you the first time. Does it? And you get used to it. I'm not sure I want to get used to it. Nah, who does? Are you the origami killer? Right, here we go, That's fast him. paced mentalist. Men mentalness. Hey, we don't get the cutscene at the Yeah? Lieutenant Carter Blake, I'd like to ask you some questions. Oh. Shit, don't just got stand there, he's gonna get away! And then it's a random hey man, watch trap it. thing. Up! Up! Hey, How the heck do I do that move? It's a triangle now. Even though it's uh, something else on something else. Hey. Oh, I got it that time. Hey, watch it, man! Whoa! I got it. Oh, why are you so hey. bad? Hey man, what's your problem? Hey. Oh, oh. for goodness sorry. sake. I'm really sorry. Up. Up. I hate it and I don't understand. At least I've caught up to him a bit hey, here. A, a, a circle, circle. I was looking at things for it. It was it was X. Say X. Now what? I think I shake it. That's what I'm remembering. Shake it. Okay. Oh. That's what the thing is do. It's I have to shake the controller. It's gonna get worse, isn't it? It doesn't get better. It only gets worse. Oh, up. I hate it! Yes, I've got control of you now. <sighs> Jeez Louise, that was so hard. At least it didn't take me as many tries as the other stupid thing. <sighs> this time it looks like we got our origami killer. You really think so? <sighs> Come on, give me my trophy. That was hard. Give me my trophy. 
Yes, thank you. Now we're going to play as Scott... Scott Calvin, is it? Scott Thingy-Majigger. So I was calling this guy uh, Scott Calvin. That is the Santa Claus. The guy who played this Santa Claus. Uh, this guy's name is Scott Shelby, not Scott Calvin. No. That's what I wanted. Whew. This is not going to be easy. It's going to be really annoying. That's what it is. Oh, weird Ugh. face. Is that what people have asked me to do? I wouldn't think so. Did I miss something? R1 uh. That's what I wanted Cause I'm happy. Right, now I can get up. I'm confused. Oh my god! Right, sorry, I I got a little bit scared. Right. I knew that I was going to happen. Could contact but you if I remembered anything. Can I come in? No. Sure. Hey. <sighs> Let me take your coat. Please, take a seat. Didn't really expect to see her again. Wonder what she wants. I just remembered something. Maybe it's not important, but a letter arrived in the mail the morning Johnny disappeared. Sure thing. A letter? What kind of a letter? It was addressed to Johnny's father. I don't know what was inside him, but he read it and then he left. That's the last time I saw him. And you think there's a connection between that letter and Johnny's death, is that it? You remember anything else about the letter? Ah, uh, here it is. Well, I don't Here's know why, letter. but I kept the envelope. Oh, he kept, she kept it. Right, I get it. It was mailed in the Carnaby district. The day before Johnny disappeared. 
Oh, nothing particular. Except the address. The address? It was typed mm -hmm. with an old typewriter. Could be a lead, you never know. Well, thanks for your help, Lord. I'll let you know if it leads to anything. Wait, I... I can't just sit around and do nothing while you're out there looking for the man who killed my son. Ever since you came around, I've been thinking, and I... I want to come with you. Help you in your investigation? Absolutely not. I'm sorry, Lauren, but that is out of the question. If you won't let me help you, I'm keeping the envelope. Oh, come it's on. It's all or nothing. All Listen, or nothing. An investigation like this is dangerous, and I don't have time to play the bodyguard. How many clues have you got, Mr. Shelby? Not enough. This envelope may be your only link to the killer. Sure I thing. Understand. It was a stupid idea. Sorry for wasting your time, Mr. Shelby. Wait. You're really something special, Lauren. I'll give you that. You're attracted to her. A mother who wants to find out who killed her son. Are we partners? Absolutely not. <sighs> We're partners. Okay, ignore me then. <sighs> now this is where things get tough. Then, <laughs> oh God. This is mental. How do we end up in situations like this? Oh, that's groovy music! I didn't know there was cool music here. Maybe you better stay in the car. Partners, remember, wherever you go, I go. Everywhere you go, always take a Lauren with you. Everywhere you go, always take a Lauren. Down and how did you get a pass? Did you? Did you? Did you? What are we doing here? Having a great time, alright? Kramer. Kramer? Am I not allowed to come and have maybe a party? Maybe we take him from Kramer Construction. Jeez, stop. Jeez, stop. Jeez, stop. But now I just have a few questions that need answers. Oh, there's dancers as well. Oh, I might need to send her something. What a noise! Oof. Kramer must be loaded! What yeah, do you loaded. So loud! We'll discuss Kramer's decor another time. Are we gonna be here long? This place gives me the creep. I'm gonna go find Gordy Kramer. You stay here till I come back. Okay? Okay. Let me know if you need me. Excuse me. Nobody allowed upstairs. No, it's so loud. Mandy Lauren. There she is. Have a seat. Why is it so loud and jabby? Leave it to me! Just be ready to go as soon as they leave the stairs! This is the guitar to fuck you all, dear. Hey, look at that guy, he's creepy and moving around weird. What's the music getting quieter? She's dead. And that's the end of Lauren, we never see her again. Hey, hey, lady, let me pass, you s Miss! Miss, are you alright? 
Absolutely not. Hey, wake up! Don't take this. Odeeing on the dance floor. Da, 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 da. Business. Deeply afraid about what I'm about to do. Move, Scott. Come on. Hopefully, it'll be quieter where I'm going. <laughs> Mr. Kramer. Wow, he looks freaky. This is the best part. <laughs> My name is Scott Shelby. I'm a private detective. I'm investigating the case of Looks the like Orange Looks relatively frame the guy. I'd like to ask you a few questions. <laughs> I'd like to know exactly what happened to little Joseph Brown. Beat it! You hear me? Beat it! The hell out of here. Now he's changed. <laughs> oh, I dread what's coming up. I dread. What do you want? Uh, factual. A witness saw little Joseph Brown get in the back of your limousine. That was the last time anybody ever saw it. Now, I know you've been arrested and interrogated until your father made a little phone call and the file was closed. I'd like to hear your version of the facts. Yeah, let's hear it, man. The kid was lost. I just offered to drive him home. You've changed completely. The police I'm afraid arrived, of you now. I explained the misunderstanding, and I was released. End of story. <sighs> Nothing Creepy. to get excited about, right? I don't know why, but your story just doesn't check out. That's a nice bed. I want a bed up. like that. Tell me something I can't believe. Now we're going to have a hard time coming up. Very well. I'm the origami killer. <gasps> no way! I get my victims into my car. I drown them in rainwater. Then I dump them on a wasteland with an origami figure in one hand and an orchid on the chest. <gasps> I do that because I'm bored, Mr. Shelby. I'm bored. It's a creative and entertaining way of having fun. Is that good enough for you? No. Or do you want more? I want more. <laughs> it's this so interview is over. <laughs> oh, God, they Get rid of this clown! No! Hey! Why? Why did that happen? Uh, there. Uh, for goodness sake, I'm messing everything up again. Uh, uh. <laughs> Wait, I beat them up already? That was easy. It's a dangerous game you're playing, Kramer. Do you know who my father is? Darth Vader? He only has to lift one finger and you won't wake up tomorrow morning. Well, that's sad. You're the one that should be afraid, Mr. Shelby. You're the one that should me. be afraid. You are pretty scary. You were nice when I first saw you, and now I hate you. You're terrifying. Get away from me. I can't believe I beat them up so easily. I was expecting to have to retry this at least three times. I beat them up in one go. I mean, I messed up a lot of the... I messed up a lot of the moves. <laughs> Look at him. He's just sitting there with his 
is beat up bodyguard. <laughs> is that a dead body in the cloth there? What's that? Let's see, did I get my trophy? Hopefully I did. Did I? Did I? Yes! Woohoo! And now it's Ethan next. I don't think I'm going to have Ethan in this episode though. Right. Maybe I will, but I don't think I will. So we've had Scott and we've had Norman in this episode. So I think that'll be the end of the episode. Hope you enjoyed. And until next time. Bye!